Hi guys, okay so we're back and we have a package to share with you guys. Now I have opened this package just to have a look to make sure everything is in it. But this package is where we got the dog food from for Lily's kitchen. As you know if you've watched our previous videos that we're going to go back to Lily's kitchen as it's best suited for them and it's more healthier and we know that we'll not have we'll know that we won't have any tummy upsets or anything like that on this food so we have decided to stick to this brand. So I made my order on, it was Cyber, on Monday, it was kind of Black Friday deal, Cyber Monday deal and I got £50 worth of food and I got 10% off, I also got free delivery. So I didn't need £50 worth of food so there was a few extra things I got with it but most part of it is food and it's enough really to last us a month so I am here to share that with you guys. I'm usually sitting in the living room just now doing this video but because of bad lighting and it's blowing a gale outside it's, and it's gale force winds and it's raining and it's battering off the window you're not really going to hear me so I'm in the back where it's not as windy. Okay so um, I ordered the food on Monday and it got delivered on Wednesday. Very quick delivery. So this is the box here and it's a nice box, lovely design and it's in good condition. So in the box I have my order leaflet basically to tell me what it is I have ordered. So there we go. Okay, so basically I got a big bag of food, we usually get two big bags of food but because I've already got a bag of food in the cupboard, I didn't get two bags, I only got the one. Now they didn't have the lamb with peas and parsley so I had to go with the woodland wok one. I also, because we're putting a spoonful of wet meat into their meal, it's just a spoonful, it's nothing, it's not as if it's a full tray or half a tray or anything like that, it's a spoonful, just to flavour the biscuits to make it a wee bit more exciting. So I've got enough wet food and enough dry food to last me a month, but obviously I had to get a little extra to bump it up to the £50. Okay, so let's pull out the first thing, and the first thing is this... Um, Lily's Kitchen Delights and I'm saving this for Christmas um, just because you know it is, it is a kind of Christmas package and I haven't got anything for the dogs for Christmas yet so this contains venison sausages with apple cider vinegar and blackberries skinny coat baked oh, skinny shiny coat baked biscuit treats red berry boost snack bars fish skin parcels now they have had um, these two before, but they haven't had these two. So that is for Christmas, Roxy. Not for just now. No, no, not for just now. It's for later. It's for later. Okay, so I'll just put that to one side. The next thing I have in here, and again, these were things just to really bump it up to the fifty pounds. I didn't want to overspend on food. Um, these are the Truly Natural Little Liver Rewards and they're 100% um, ox liver. It's a bit like the Beautiful Joes that we get in the Paw Post box every month. Um, so it is 100% ox liver and they are quite big even though it says Little Rewards. So we've got them as well. Now there is our big bag of food. Oh pull it out. Here we go. So it is the Woodland Walk and this has a feast of venison duck with salmon and they really do like this one. All natural, freshly prepared meats and fish, active fruits, healthy vegetables, natural and holistic ingredients, biotanical herbs, omega-3 and 6 for shiny coat and it is also grain free. I did get the 2.5 kilogram bag and um, we didn't have this bag of this size of bag available for the lamb with peas and parsley but there's just a wee kind of overview of the bag 
Again, I'm using my wee digital camera here. It might not be as good quality as my phone, but my phone is a bit pants with the lighting, so it's a bit rubbish. So that's the food. So they've got that food, and they also have the chicken and duck to last the month, and they'll get a scoop of that with a tiny teaspoon of white meat. A meal. Okay, now we did also get a free item with our box and I don't know if it's because we ordered on the weekend or Black Friday or the Monday even, it was Cyber Monday but it was the Black Friday deals and we got this free. So this is like a, it's a dish towel really but it's like, I don't know if you can see. Okay, so there you go. So there is our dish towel and it says natural and nutritious food for dogs and cats and then it's got the lovely wee stations and where Lily lives, the inn, all that kind of stuff. So that is really, really nice and it's a lovely, nice free gift. So thank you Lily's Kitchen. Okay, now I just really got a selection of trays and tins just to try a variety of flavours. They have been on most of the flavours apart from the tins. They've been on most of the trays and they have managed fine. They've had no stomach upsets, anything like that. So I'm hoping that we can get on with this and they will eat and not be fussy or anything like that. I was kind of thinking, well, they're having the same biscuits all the time. So they may have, or they may enjoy a different flavour of meat every couple of days or every week. And it kind of like mixes it up for them and makes it a bit more interesting. So first of all, we got the natural selection. Now, they didn't have any of the cottage pie and I'm really disappointed because I had one left in the drawer and while Pixie was not well and having rice and chicken, Roxy was back on Lily's kitchen. She was on the organic chicken kibble with the cottage pie meat and it was only a spoonful she was getting and she absolutely loved it. But they didn't have that on option to buy on the Lily's kitchen website. So, first of all, we have got fish supper. Don't know how they're going to go with fish but we'll wait and see. Um, and again we just divide down the middle and then we divide it twice along the side and that gives us six cubes to spoon out so that will do us three meals. So a day and a half that will do us four. So I have enough trays to last us about 25 days and then I have tins to boost it up to the, the month mark. So I've got the fish supper, I've got the lamb feast, and I've got two of them, basically got two of everything. I've got two of the natural range herby chicken, which they really, really like, and the same with this one. And I also got the foragers feast with apples and blueberries, and the same again. Now this contains... Um, turkey, game, beef, butternut squash, apples, blueberries, cranberries, minerals, rosemary, probiotics, peppermint, rose hips and green tea extract. So, all healthy and we love it. They have tried these ones before, so I'm not really um, worried about it running right through them or them not having it before because they have ate it all before and they have had no upsets whatsoever. So... That is them. The next one we got was a tray of, and I just wanted to get all of one flavour, um, just to stick on to, first of all, to try and get them back into it before I start mixing things up a bit. So we got a tray of, I think it was 11, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I've got 10 in here, but we're using one just now. Um, and it's the Organic Chicken Supper. And it's basically just full of 100% controlled organic farming, meat content 50% including organic chicken, 30% organic pork, 10% organic turkey. Vegetables include organic carrots, organic peas, organic spelt, organic alfalfa, 
Organic Cleavers, Organic Spirulina, Kelp, Vitamins and Minerals. So that is very, very healthy. Probably the healthiest you can get in dog food. Um, so I have, I live, well I've got 10 trees now, we're using one, but um, I've got plenty of them. So that is them. What's your tail? Come on. Here we go. Don't want to break your hair. Okay, and the last ones were the tins, which they have not tried any of the tins before, so this is really a bonus. Um, and again, this was just so I could bump it up to the, the 50 pounds. Okay, so first of all, we have got the Lily's Kitchen and it's home style chicken and turkey casserole. And they're just half tins. There is, let me just double check, 200 grams in a tin. There is 150 grams in a tray. So 150, 200. Um, and this one is the lamb hot pot. So that will last maybe an extra, an extra meal. So that will maybe last the two days. And then we have two of the bigger tins just because I wanted to try the flavour and review them and see what the dogs thought of them. So this, you can keep these refrigerated for up to two days, it says on this one. So it just means that when I give them this, they might require a wee bit more meat, which is fine. It will be a one-off anyway. I'm not going to be getting big tins in my next order. It's going to be either the wee tins or the big trees. So this one is a wild campfire stew. And this one contains, let me see, where are we? Prepared venison, pheasant, salmon, organic potatoes, butternut squash, organic green beans, apples, vitamins and minerals. So all the ingredients in that is organic. So that is a very healthy tin. Very, very healthy. And it's lovely. I love the packaging on these. I really do. And the last one we got is an English garden party. Now, we're from Scotland, but an English garden party sounds absolutely lovely. And on this, or in this, should I say, we have prepared chicken, organic potatoes, carrots, strawberries, green beans, spinach, hemp oil, vitamins and minerals. So again, another organic tin. So I'm really excited to try these ones out and see what um, it's like. So as I said, we are changing back onto Lily's Kitchen. We are going to be putting in a spoonful of wet meat into their meal. It's not going to do them any harm. This is probably the healthiest meat that you can get, or at least I think it is um, in terms of the UK. And they are going to love it and they will eat with it because it has wet meat in it and I don't need to worry about them being sick or not eating or being fussy, changing food again. We are sticking to Lily's Kitchen and we are not budging. We will find a way around if they're not going to eat. But for the meantime, this is going to be their food from now on. Lily's Kitchen, I find, is the healthiest and most natural brand in the UK so far. And I am really, really happy with the products. They really like them as well. They like the treats. They like the wet food. They kind of like the biscuits if it's not on its own. Um, so we are really happy to stay with that. So that is our order um, for Lily's Kitchen. And the dogs are just chilled out at the moment. It's kind of dinner time right now. So I would need to start preparing their dinner. Now, I just want to share... Um, what it is we got pre in a previous Lily's Kitchen order that is for Christmas and it's something that I didn't video really um, I just never got around to doing a video on that box but I would like to share what it is that we got from Lily's Kitchen in that order and this is the cutest thing ever it is a, a Woofmas, a Merry Woofmas, Woofmas? advent calendar for dogs and as you can see we're on the fourth today and we have opened four windows and these are the biscuits it contains in the back so it's got the, the cheese and apple training treats the rise and shines and the bedtime biscuits which they've all had before and they all like and eat so that will be a nice surprise daily for the dogs to open and um, they have their advent calendar the next thing i got was the tin Again, the big tin, and it's Three Birds Feast. 
Merry Christmas Three Birds Feast and this contains turkey, goose, duck, parsnips, organic carrots, cranberries, swiss chard, organic apples, vitamins, minerals, seaweed, biotanical herbs. So this is their Christmas dinner. Now it will do Christmas dinner and it will probably do Boxing Day as well because they're not going to have it all in a winner. They will have it with biscuits. So again that's another large tin but that will be their Christmas dinner. And then we have one of their treats which is the Christmas biscuits and it's turkey, cranberry, thyme and cinnamon. These are wee love heart shaped biscuits and I don't think these are, are no, there's no organic ingredients in this but it's all natural anyway. Lily's Kitchen don't always do organic, they do natural and they do organic so it's a bit of both really. So that is their treat, treats for Christmas. And we gave a box of these to Stassi the Jew in America and we also gave them an advent calendar um, for Christmas as well, just as a wee extra, a wee extra something something for them to open. Okay, so that is our order. And as I said, the delivery was really, really quick. I'll have the website of Lily's Kitchen down below if you fancy taking a wee look. Like the video, leave us a comment, and as always, do not forget to subscribe to our channel, and we will see you guys later. Bye!